I'm Jeremy from the brewery. I'm here to talk about a couple beers today. Uh, right now we're gonna talk about We All Scream. So We All Scream is another one of our ice cream inspired beers. Um, ice cream inspired beers go back quite a ways here at the brewery. We did a couple beers in the past called uh, Hold the Spoon. Um, those are kind of, uh, you know, ice cream inspired beers uh, that, were, that were actually brewed to be an ice cream beer. Uh, and then over the last couple of years, we've been doing some barrel aged stouts that are, um, you know, high gravity brews, uh, a lot of residual sugar left in the beer, uh, pre barrel aging, and then barrel aging it for an appropriate amount of time. And then doing um, sort of an ice cream sort of uh, treatment on it. Uh, some of those beers have been, you know, big winners for us, uh, you know, including First, which was a beer we did with uh, Three Cheese Brewing Company. That was a, a big, big, big viscous stout with a Neapolitan sort of uh, treatment. Uh, and then last year we did a beer called Scoop Scoop Scoop, which was um, a beer inspired by uh, First, but uh, Scoop 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 had, you know, just the vanilla, the cacao, and the strawberry. Um, and that was a Black Tuesday treatment. So, you know, very a very uh, attenuated uh, stout that was aged in bourbon um, for about 18 months and then, you know, back sweetened with strawberry, uh, cacao and vanilla beans. So this year, you know, we wanted to come up with a new beer. We All Scream is that beer. Uh, we All Scream is another Neapolitan beer, but it's a little bit different in the fact that this beer is kind of a collection of barrel aged stouts uh, from our bourbon barrel stock, if you will. Uh, it's it's a, a little bit of blending that we've been doing this year to try to differentiate some of our stouts. You know, most of these blends include a little bit of Black Tuesday, uh, but more importantly, they include some one-off barrels from not only our pilot program, but also uh, some of our past releases. Uh, for instance, uh, some barrels of One and Done made it into this blend, and some barrels of our Monster Stout made it into this blend. And then, you know, a little a little trickery here or there, you know, when we find a, a different kind of stout that we've been working on. and and want to um, lengthen out a blend, um, we'll throw a barrel or two of that in as well. So um, We All Scream is a little bit different. Bourbon barrel aged stout treated pretty heavily with not only strawberry, but cacao and vanilla. So I'm gonna crack this guy right now, give him a little pour in my glass. You know, I just had a nice lunch, so nothing like a, nothing like a nice stout right afterwards. Um, the first thing that jumps off the nose on this is strawberry. It's got a very, very sweet smell, but it's a pop of red fruit for sure. Secondary to that, you get a little bit of roast and um, probably some like baker's chocolate, if you will. Sweet beer. And the viscosity is what, you know, carries carries the all of the flavor. So up front, it's sweet with a red fruit, strawberry sort of uh, tingle on the front of your tongue. Kind of settles back into um, some deep, rich cacao flavors and then you know, the retro nasal uh, vanilla coming uh, really strong. The vanilla is like the major aftertaste in the beer. But ideally, you know, probably the best way to describe this beer is a dessert beer. It is very creamy. So, you know, a very, very creamy beer. And the creaminess isn't from a lactose type of uh, sensation or use of, it's actually from, man, I think that vanilla and the, and the copious amounts of cacao that are in there mixing together and giving you this like, this mouthfeel that not only is, is sweet and viscous, but creamy. You know, another ice cream beer, well made by the brewery. Cheers. Mm -hmm.